Hey, you tourists, it's your boy, Domination. This is Rebecca the Grace that Chugga to do South Texas Bay Mountain Dust back. You know this, it is. Real men rust up, fake men rust up. Real rust up, fake rust down. Proud to where I preach or preach on. And today's topic I want to talk about is, I want to talk about this movie I just watched yesterday, man. This film, this piece of shit film right here. Man, let's talk about it. What the fuck is Netflix thinking for put out a film like this? Coffee and Kareem. <laughs> Coffee and Kareem. That's the, what the movie called. Uh, t TV uh, 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 maturity. One twenty eight mi minutes. A action and comedy. It was just released by April the 3rd. Yeah. A, a 20... Uh, 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 he's 12 years old. I thought he's. I thought no. I figure he's 12 years old. Yeah, 12 year old boy. 12 year old boy. Ain't that some? Uh, a 12 year old Kareem Minner hired a criminal to scare his mom' new boyfriend. The police officer James Coffee, but it's backfired to force Coffee and Kareem to team up in order to save their selves from Detroit most ruthless drug kingpin. Let, let me say this. This is this is one of the worst piece of shit bullshit ass fucking films I ever seen in my life. It, it's just as bad. I even heard this from uh uh double toast. If you never heard of double toast double uh toast it shout out to them because they talk about this and it was directed by Michael Downrick and the writer, Sean Mack. I don't know where they get this goddamn movie from. They just adding on, adding on some shit that just me adding on with. It's just, it, it's, it's a terrible ass movie. This movie to me is like Cleveland meets the, 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 the different strokes. Living in a rich family, but it really live in a lower income family that couldn't take care of a single mother because the father probably left, abandoned the son and abandoned the mother. A 12-year-old boy, bad misfit, misfit, bad year old child. He need a belt on his ass. I swear, this kid was so fucking bad. My, my father would lay a hand on my ass and my mother for being managed, managed ass child. It don't make no sense. And you got a, 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 a stepfather being the playing the stepfather role, being the father that he never had, so he can be help of God and directing his life. And I'm gonna talk about the mother in a minute because it's it's crazy about that. So the stars is Edwin Hines and Jada with Peterson, Terrence Little, Gudley and Hanna High. Yeah, the three movies. I mean three three stars. They the three stars. The kid, the the white dude. And Tita uh, Peters, uh, Hans, uh, uh, Jennifer P. Hansen, whatever her name. She fine, don't get me wrong. But she play as a fucking single mom. How many times you see movies, they always put the single black mother living on welfare. Oh, I can't find me a good man, good black man. So I'm going to find myself a good get, 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 this, get uh, scrutinized and scrutinate with a white man. Because he can show the better for go white guys are better, even though he find out he's piece of shit like any other man, everybody else, and give a chance to work it out. And the, it, it also his name is Edward Hines. This is the same guy who's in the movie called um, Hangover One, Two, and Three. He was in the movie. He played Coffee, James Coffee, and 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 Jennifer Peterson and Jennifer Peter Henderson. Who played Vanessa Minnitted and the uh, uh uh whatever his name is uh Terrence Little Gregory Hine play Kareem. This this boy is so fucking bad, boy. I tell you, man. And 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 then they got the crazy ass white woman trying to get a better promotion like Betty Gunley Penn, the the uh, detective uh uh Watts, and then you got the you know the uh david out Al, uh, uh, david out Al, in green 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 and uh, captain hall and, and you know stuff like that they were team up together with the gangster knives gangster men sexualized sexual with black men play uh rodney and andrew uh uh uh, uh, uh bachelor uh, andrew bachelor yeah he played this goddamn gangster guy and he spoils himself in a special sex to show his 
his his his his wing attain. They always obsess about our sexuality. They've been doing it for years. Well, white people just stop that shit. But you never hear anybody obsess white men's sexuality. Oh, they don't play that stuff. No. And he they and there was one part he was in the drug bus when he was playing on the drugs or something they was gonna plan the drug gone bad. They bust the guy and, and he, he he running butt ass, ass naked, showing his wangatang on and a one piece of shirt. What kind of shit is this? And then you got this. 12 year old badass bad mr badass boy trying to get rid of his stepdad because he dating his mom he was cussing didn't know shit about school and school women and his mother trying to get the 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 uh whatever you want to call it she trying to get her 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 needly freak on and you know how that go i, I it's one of the worst pieces of movie i ever seen in my life the movie is so bad you can burn a goddamn fluid of the lighting fluid of, of the whole burnt burnt burn the field it burned to a cattle with fire it's that bad folks i give a two i give a one and a half and a two it was one of the worst fucking films i ever seen in my life netflix y'all need y'all ass with straight up man because y'all could have did better than this hope it's worth it for my money because it better be a good count, I'll tell you. They need to do better than this. This is one of the worstest fucking movies. The worstest. I give it one and two and a half. It's that fucking bad. It's one of the worst fucking movies ever. And, and it's not a surprise this movie shot in Detroit. And what is Detroit known for? The home of Eminem. And not only the home of other rappers. Uh, street Lords. Rest in peace to Blade Icewood and 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 and, and, and um uh wipe out and and East, East Side Cheddar Boys and all this other goddamn bullshit. I mean, look at this shit, man. You mean you mean to tell me a twelve misfit, misfit, bad, misfit ass boy trying to get rid of his stepdad because he tried to take his mother away from him? And there was a part he tasted his mother when the when the trouble situation when when things would get occupied the men Rodney stole his phone for the evidence they shot the, a police officer two black three stooges of a bunch of f fucking men and the idiot and they are city from the fucking hood I mean are you serious this guy all he is is nothing but a dirty mouthpiece this little boy just talking shit. And ain't doing a damn thing. He just talk shit. He didn't fight or nothing. He just talk shit. Talk shit. Be on his phone all day. Talking about he going to whack this goddamn officer. He ain't whack for shit. He know he going to be in Jubo Hall if he did something like that. Fuck this movie. It's one of the worst movies. I would never want to see it again. It is just as bad as the goddamn movie called The Sex tri uh, Triplets. If you've never seen it, Ma Damon Wayne movie... Go watch that. Martin, Mar Martin Wayans. Martin. Not David Wayans. Martin Wayans. It was that horrible. He made a, a double uh, 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 psycho psycho queen to himself and, and trying to find a part of him and lost the family he never had. Get the fuck out of here. So if, if y'all like this movie, and I'm not going to tell you the, the fucked up end of it. I'm not. Because this end is so fucked up. It just it just bring the cutscene out of cut of fuckery. So if you all want to see coffee and 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 uh, 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 and and and, and, and cof, coffee and, and, and Kareem, coffee Kareem, if you want to see it, as came out 2020, a TV uh, uh, mature and one 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 twenty eight minutes act, act action and comedy, and it was it just came out April the third, 2020, and 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 the and the director. Is, is Michael Darwin, Michael Michael Downward, Michael Downward, that's his name, Michael Downward, Michael Downward, director Michael Downward, and the writer Sean Mack, and the stars of the movie, Edwin Hines and J.P. Hansen, and, 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 um, and uh, Terrence Little uh, Gardening Hines, yeah, that's his name, so it's, it's, it's not a good movie. It's like me too moving bullshit, trying to show show the report of Black Lives Matter, all lives matter, no life not matter anything in this movie. No matter to lies anybody who fuck everyone's lives up. This is this is one of the the worstest 
movies I ever seen in the year 2000, 2020. It's the worst. You got a white woman to try to get a big promotion for this guy, and he jealous of the white woman, right? And then you got a single mother whooping these dudes' asses and and trying to say they need I can that their mother should have handled them wood. Black women, white women, please stop it. They make black men look like idiots. They make white men look as dumb as fuck because they are taught, oh, I'm a superior. You dumb asses. And just as a joke is white women and black women. Y'all know, y'all know where to be found when Anthony Casey killed her first child. Where, where the fuck are y'all? Y'all know where to be found. Y'all didn't say a fucking word. So fuck feminists. Fuck all this Me Too movement, Time's Up shit. And fuck all this, the, the, the gay and lesbian community. And no offense. But this shit is one of the worst fucking films. It put a gay reference of the fucking movie. How he put a falsely claimed charges on his father trying to get him in trouble that, that, that his stepdad trying to molest this black child. Man, get the fuck out of here. I gotta go, man. If you want to see it, it's up to you. It's just as bad. This movie's so bad, you could stick a lighter fluid in someone's ass and then it'd be gone in the midship in the back of D-Lake and D-Lake the factory. It's just as bad. So go see it and, and tell me what you think of this movie. Uh, Coffee and Kareem. So I don't like it, so you might like it. And and give me your rent of what, uh, uh, your ratings with the movie if you think if you like it or not. So that's all I can say about that. It's your boy, Domination. This is Back of the Basic. Chugging the Deuce Out Taste, baby. Till next time. All right? All right. Peace. I'm out. All right. Peace.